So hello guys and gals, me and Muda Heart, chill uh, night tonight. You know, we've had E3 kicking up, we've had a bunch of things sort of kicking around here and there, and frankly, it's been an interesting week. Now, I've had some internet issues to deal with, but hopefully I was planning to get back on streaming, and today I sort of have a kick in the dick, I guess you could say. Some people would say, actually, I got a little uh, notification on my phone, let me just uh, turn that off for a real second. Uh, but, ladies and gentlemen... Uh, remember the videos I made, uh, the YouTube, uh, issues that were kicking up, the ones where I was, I can't even actually show you this video because I don't want to get this one flagged in this instance, but there was a video that I made where I focused on the YouTube pornographic problem. You remember the time where people are putting, like, weird pornographic, like, J Ap Japanese, uh, adult video stills and some videos of women scantily clad, obviously, into these playlists aimed towards children, and I, I remember at the time I said it was, like, some weird, uh, internet, like, laundering scheme or something. It, it was weird, okay? It was it was an interesting situation that kicked up. And I made that video purely to sort of bring it up to YouTube's attention or sort of at least raise awareness of an issue that was building up on YouTube, one that would sort of affect the, the YouTube content creators again and the YouTube platform in of itself. But I see, it seems as though that your boy has received, if you can see, a uh, community guideline strike, which actually revokes me from live streaming privileges. Now, of course, if I hit see details, you can actually see the video that I got attacked on was YouTube, you need to fix this. The reason that it was removed is for a violation of YouTube's policy and spam and deceptive practices. It expires on the 10th of September, 2018, which means I'll be able to live stream again on YouTube there and there. And again, here I'd really want to do like a shameless plug. I do want to live stream, and as much as I don't agree with the Twitch platform, it's kind of all I have right now, and I know as dead as my Twitch channel is, rightfully so, I haven't streamed to it properly for like, what, two years at this point? I will leave the link in the description, www.twitch.tv slash someordinarygamers. Please follow over there so that I can at least, you at least can see a live stream or so kick up. But for now, uh, I can't stream on YouTube because of a community guidelines strike. Now, at the process, I'm actually talking to a couple people who are in the YouTube's, uh, YouTube flagger, uh, sort of like the trusted flagger list over here. I don't know if I can exactly list a name over here, but I'll, I'll ask them, I'll, I'll annotate it, I guess, if the situation goes across, see how it comes across in whatever. But regardless, the video has been deemed by YouTube to be, I guess, deceptive or full of spam practices. I checked the description and tags and title myself, and nothing in it seemed egregious to me in any way, shape, or form. I don't do that. There were two instances in my YouTube career where I was flagged, and I totally agree with those flags, by the way. If you don't remember, I had the nostalgic web browsing flag where I showed a pornographic image of two women naked kissing for like a second. I didn't know that Zelda.com would lead to a fucking lesbian porno site, but apparently it did. And I accept that because I made a mistake. I should have vetted the site. I should have done something. Instead, I showed porn even for a second live and I accept that strike. There was another set of strikes that came from, I think it was spam 404 at the time because I put my tags into description. It was a, I guess, common YouTube practice I had sort of seen and adapted at a time. I made a mistake on that. I changed every single video and Voila, I learned my lesson. I made a mistake at that point, and I wholly accept my mistakes. I think that's what being a fucking man or a, or a human being is about. But one thing that I won't accept is this, in any way, shape, or form. I think what YouTube has done in this situation is wrong. Now, again, I give YouTube the benefit of the doubt, again, because I know that, for the most part, 90% of this site is run by robots or an algorithm. I think what had happened was the community that I had, I guess, sort of brought up in that had immediately removed their videos. If you remember, as soon as I posted that video, an hour later, all those videos were gone. People removed them, hid their channels, they went into hiding. And I think there was a lot of targeted strikes on that video specifically, uh, maybe some form of privacy complaints, I don't know. It's why I censor, like, channel names to begin with, because people get pissy and they find the tiniest exploit, and I think what happened was this video got taken down for some egregious reason. And in that way, shape, or form, I've received a three-month strike notice, I guess, on this channel. So in three months, it'll be gone if I don't do anything wrong, which I don't see myself doing anything wrong because I don't do that to begin with. But I've gotten a strike, and it's one of the things that I've appealed to YouTube with. I'm trying to see what I can do to fix this because it is a nonsense strike. There's nothing in that video that was spammy to begin with. Look... I give a lot of crap to Ali A, I give a lot of crap to like, you know, Cernando and all those individuals, and for the most part, you know, I'll say something. They do their hustle, they do it fine, they do whatever they can, but listen, there's a lot of clickbait, there's a lot of scam, there's a lot of deception, 
that is on YouTube. There's a lot of deceptive practices that kick in. And the problem is, this one was not one of them. You've got people over here giving fake giveaways, they've got people doing fake nonsense all the time, they've got people getting away with the biggest clickbait nonsense out there, and they don't get their videos touched at all by YouTube's algorithm, which, but, but the video that I made targeting an actual problem got targeted by YouTube, maybe in a way that they got exposed for something they let fly for so long. And it's not just me saying it, it's literally every other trusted flagger out there, Ben Trusted Flagger, the Twitter account out there, actually focuses on some of these. I, I remember the last thing I did, five minutes before making this video, I looked at his Twitter profile, called out a Fortnite giveaway scam, but YouTube let, lets it go on or so forth. So for some weird shape reason, YouTube lets this stuff go day in and day out. There's nothing sort of against it. And I guess that's all I really have to say about it. You know, plug in my Twitch channel once again if you want to see me live stream once my internet issue gets fixed. God, I hate Canadian internet service providers. They're horrible. But God bless Canada. I'll always defend it. It's my, it's my, it's my birthplace, dude. It's my, it's my place, my, my, my home. But that's not what it's about, dude. I can be patriotic day in and day out. But all I really gotta make a video on is it is some nonsense. It's some it's some bull pucky. Okay, I can't even say swear words. I'm pretty sure anymore. <laughs> but YouTube apparently found me calling them out for allowing this kind of weird pornographic child playlist trend. They get they punished me, but those channels they get to do what I guess they they get to do. So let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. Obviously, I'm fighting to get this stuff revoked. Hopefully, in by the end of the week, something I should be, or in the next couple days, I should be able to figure out something over here. But I've got more videos coming out on the way. Tomorrow, we've got a virus investigations video with me being your virus teacher for the week. Ladies and gentlemen, this is me, Mudahar. If you like what you saw, please like, comment, and subscribe. Just like if you dislike it. YouTube, I, I apologize, dude. God, I, I, I don't think I can ever talk about a YouTube problem anymore, dude. Christ, YouTube doesn't take too kindly to that. This is and have a good one, I, I guess is all I can say. I'm out.